Hey guys, welcome back to RTD Speaks. This is Miriam Gad, and today we're gonna be looking at 200,000 people who marched in London for Palestine. So let's take a look. So today I'm with Nyla at the protest. Last time I was by myself, today I have a friend. <laughs> oh my god, I need to. countries and they're living terrible lives. 80 million people, the largest ever in recorded history. However, God, on the day of judgment, Allah will question us, especially our imams in every mosque. We have over 3,000 masjid in UK. Our Muslim brothers and sisters, 
this is the time we need to come out to raise our voices, raise our voices for justice and equality and fairness. Not only when Muslims are suffering, we should be coming out for any human being yes. when they are suffering, yes. when they are in hardship. We Muslims have to raise our voice in any injustice. If only Muslims unite, our religion like actually unite, us. Every we would be somewhere Quran, else, man. The Imam, the Khatib, they recite, in Allah, ya'muru bil adli wal ihsan. Indeed, Allah, He commands you to do justice. Adl, justice yes. and ihsan. Ihsan is, then, is a higher degree than justice. Justice is equality. However, our Prophet, he told us, if someone does injustice to you, you do be good, you be good to him. You yes. be good to her. So our religion is a re religion of higher standard. We have to show our yes. good character. Today, if you see in the history of Islam, how did Islam spread? Because yes. of good character. Because of, of our, how we deal with other people, how we behave, our worship. Our, our Iman, our faith is not going to attract the non-Muslims towards Islam in their millions and billions. Only thing which will attract the non-Muslims towards Islam is the Mu'amalat, uh, Mu'asharat and Akhlaq. Yes. While we have neglected these three uh, aspects of Islam, we only practicing and preaching two-fifths of Islam. And three-fifths of Islam we have totally neglected and we don't even have the knowledge of them. We need to revive those uh, aspects of Islam, then we'll see how humanity will come back to Islam and find the peace and the, the, uh, they will find the purpose of life. Okay guys, so this video is really really interesting. Um, I love how we have this huge amount of people who are marching for Palestine. This is this is beyond perfect to be honest. Yes, the situation is still not perfect, but the fact that we have this number of people going out to support Palestine even though a lot of them might not be Arabs or they might not be Muslims and yet they are against anything that's inhumane that's honestly beyond perfection I'm so happy I'm so proud that we have those Muslims around us who not only defend Palestine but they also defend the religion and that guy who talked at the end though man that was good he he just summed it up he just said what needed to be said and i think people need to start listening more because um yeah he's right and islam is about peace and people cannot just wish others to be dead like that guy who said oh if you're a jew i'm gonna come after you like what is this like no no like yes we're against israelis we're against anyone who's out for blood or out to kill or whatever yes we're against that but like also this is not the message that we want to send out to the world because if we can't control ourselves and what we say we're opening room for people to come and say oh look at this these are the muslims they're bad people whatever like no 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 a lot of people need to actually understand this as a muslim i would say that a lot of other muslims are just putting out the wrong image for islam and how muslims should talk or give advice or stop judging anyway i would like to say that i wish and hope that all those protests increase all over the world because the situation in uh, Palestine just needs to stop right now. So please come out, come out more, be there, support Palestine, raise out your voice, say free Palestine because this is what needs to happen right now. And I think this is where I'm gonna end it guys. I hope you like the video. Tell us what you think down below in the comment section. Did you like the video or didn't you like it? Uh, did you go out in protest and support Palestine? And if you did, tell us how you felt about it. Tell us what you did. Also, you're gonna find other videos that we have in the video description section. You can check them out if you wanna know more about what we have. And that's it for me, guys. I would like to see you later. Bye!